Hi, this is Mark. I'd like to talk to you about some quantum computing stocks. Uh, I actually own three of them or owned three of them. I sold two in the last two days. I own QTBS, which was a quantum D-wave uh, stock, which really moved nicely. It doubled. I own uh, IO, IONQ, which is an ion jumping type uh, quantum computing stock. Uh, that actually went in half, so I lost money on that. So if you took the two stocks together, IONQ and QBTS, uh, then I've kind of broke even on them. Uh, and then I own Rigetti computers. Well, recently the stock prices have been dropping. IONQ had been dropping for a while. Uh, QBTS had been running up. It ran up to about $2.40 and pulled down to about $2. I ended up selling it at $1.97. That might be a big mistake for that stock because it was really moving nicely. Uh, but I am so used to watching my price of my stocks go down and watching them go down. It's it just disheartening. I wanted to get some profit out of it. Uh, IONQ uh, and QBTS versus Rigetti. I think the big differences are uh, Rigetti and QBTS. They use super cold uh, temperatures for their processing environment where uh, IONQ uses, uh, I guess, room temperature. They don't need that big freezing amount. But I think their computers are much bigger. Their, their uh, computers are based in uh, University of Maryland and a bunch of other places. They had quite a bit of hype. The stock was up to about $18. I had bought it. Foolish, big foolish mistake, and now it's half. So if I compared the pattern of IONQ when people got excited about that, and looked at the other stocks, I, I look at 240 and I say, in QBTS, and I say, well, wow, that stock, if it went in half, what would it be? You know, obviously it would be about $1.20, which I might want to buy it back at somewhere around $1.15, $1.20. Uh, it's an exciting world. If quantum computing really works, I think the hype about uh, AI with NVIDIA's chips and everything will kind of fade away. And uh, we'll be back to the mainframe environment where people are accessing these quantum computers. Uh, that's pretty much all I know about it. I know that they can figure out, you know, complex math and complex computing problems. And the world is desperate for it. We are in a very bad situation worldwide, whereas we have so many resource problems. We have so many uh, potential military problems, medical problems, and everybody's looking to compute information much quicker and to implement AI on the right platform. So I do think that the environment for quantum computing is right. Uh, I just don't know uh, if the possibilities are 100% clear yet. But I do think that this is a trending type industry. I will definitely be back into it. I hope I didn't make a big mistake by selling. Uh, but uh, it seems pretty uh, exciting. So that's all I have to really say about uh, QTBS or QBTS and uh, RGTI and IONQ. Uh, I'm in play. Thanks and have a nice evening. This is Mark from Newsweed.com. Please leave comments and educate me because obviously I, I don't know much about quantum computing.